Okay, guys. This kind of proves it. Pixamon shows up randomly. This is the same exact day that I did yesterday. I checked at this same exact time. It wasn't here. So this, in all honesty, proves he is just effing random as hell. So, with that being said, let's fight him and make sure that I have all the correct stuff. Alright, I do. F U Pixiemon. Uh, you're really lucky to meet me. I don't look like it, but I'm Ultimate Digimon. If you beat me, I'll help you. Yeah, I'm down. I'm down to whoop your ass because you've been pissing me off. Because you haven't been showing up when I have an ultimate Digimon, you mother trucker. And actually, ironically, that's actually one of the moves that uh, Monzamon can learn. Confused Storm right there. Uh, it's about the only other Digimon that we can learn it from. Uh, that's outside of Mount Infinity, besides Erdramon, but we all know that we knocked him out like 10 episodes ago, if not longer. But, um, most people do not like fighting Pixiemon. Mostly due to a lot of stuff. One of which is pretty much just Confused, so uh, confused Storm. The other being uh, the bug, and the other being poison jab, I believe, which is that right there. And then his finisher is just nasty, which he's gonna demonstrate. Lucky me. Yeah, 1800. It's, I guess it's not really that bad, but nah, it's still decent. I personally have never had that much trouble against Pixiemon, so I really don't see what the effing problem is. And that just kind of pissed me off. I was going to use my finisher, but no. See, I guess this is a good thing to have uh, protection floppies, so uh, this still doesn't happen. And that, thanks. That's awesome. Yeah. Give it to him. Huh. I guess it is pretty good that he's using Confusion so a lot. Because I guess <laughs> I might just have a good chance at learning it since he's using it like every other move. And F U. Yeah, bring it. I really don't care. Yeah, screw Pixiemon. Seriously, look at that. He's using it like every other move. Ha! <laughs> Sucker, you rocked right into it. And actually, ironically, I don't think I've ever seen uh, two Digimon confused at the same time. But yeah, that move right there is Bug. It is probably his most deadliest move in his move set mostly because it can hit up to two or three times and uh, that's mostly due to uh, well is it the bugs running around even after some of them exploded because if you guys notice there's multiple bugs uh, dropped and running around and on top of that, not all of them explode at once, so, yeah. But with that, we beat Pixiemon. Yay. Who is our final Digimon that we had to recruit for the city? Yes. Go figure. So, pretty much with that, I can safely say we can kind of get ready for the whole Mount Infinity uh, finales. So see, I, I told you guys in the little update video that um, 
I knew that the finales for this game and Ape Escape are going to be coming up pretty fast. And this kind of proves it, because, I mean, huh, all I really needed was Piximon, Nanimon, and Monjimon, and, well, this kind of proves it right there. I mean, pretty much after to this, uh, I just had to go and kill off Monjimon, and then, uh, what was it? Uh... Get Mama Mon. Son of a monkey freaker. Yes, I didn't mean to actually spoil what this one I was gonna get, but I'm I am trying uh, gonna try and get Mama Mon. The reason is because if you guys remember back, I don't know. Uh -huh. I probably say about episode. 15, 16, or 17. Um, I was talking about learning full potential from a Gardramon. I showed you guys how to get it. And that Gardramon that we learned it from will ironically actually quote unquote transform your Digimon or remodel your Digimon. And Pretty much all you need is Mamamon, and you have, uh, uh, it's pretty much like another slide Digivolution, kind of like, what is it, um, uh, Metal Greymon to Skull Greymon, that was the slide evolution, and then kind of like Angemon to Devimon, that's the slide evolution too. And I believe, actually, Bergemon to Ergemon is a slide evolution. But, it, yeah, it's that kind of type of evolution where uh, Mamumon could either digivolve to Metal Mamumon or there was another Digimon, I believe. I could be mistaken about that. But uh, those two, uh, you can pretty much slide digivolve to. So, yeah. But with Pixmon here, uh, huh, I like that. Huh. Uh, if you guys didn't read that while I was talking, uh, Pixmon said, uh, something about Mr. I do want to buy a secret item. And then I just love that. After it, Jizuan's just like, Pixmon worries me. That was just great. Yeah, <coughs> we're at 87. Angemon will pretty much say that there's unknown Digimon. And pretty much all the unknown Digimon. Okay, that that's really weird. Oh, that's why. I was seeing her, I'm like, okay, that's really weird because I believe it's your mom would be right here. And I'm like, what the hell? But yeah, Angemon's here. <laughs> <coughs> worthless, worthless Andromon. But, um, so if you guys are wondering what Pixmon does, he's in here at the item shop right there. Uh, he's completely random, and luckily when I actually went in, he is actually here. Yeah, he will sell you a training manual for. I believe 50,000 uh, 50,000 bits. Oh yeah, it was 50,000 bits. And what the training manual does, we'll tra uh, you'll train better with it. So, pretty much in combination with uh, the Kowagmon, Commentary Mon, the training manual, and eating a super carrot, I believe it is, you can pretty much effectively get the maximum amount of training you possibly could can. Uh, and just to kind of start off, there's an animal right over there in that little corner. You really can't talk to him or anything. But um, what was I gonna say? That uh, that's pretty much how you can train effectively. And pretty great. 
in my opinion, because oh yeah, well what I forgot to say is uh, you only need one training manual. That's all you need. Uh, you don't use it. You just keep it in your inventory, and yeah. Uh, what is it? I'm just gonna kind of show it off. If you, normally uh, without everything, you would only gain about uh, I think sixty, maybe sixty, seventy, or eighty, somewhere in between there. And then with Quagmon, I believe it increased it a little more. Well, Quagmon and Capitaramon. And then with the Super Carrot, it will raise it to about 120. And then with... Oh, crap. That was not good. Um, with Training Manual, it will raise it to about 130 or 13. And then... If I can actually show it off, uh, and uh, I will be using save states for this, uh, with bonus try, if you guys are looking, you want to try and get the uh, shite. Um, you're going to want to try and go for the little poop, golden poop. Uh, which I am hor now yeah, right there. You want to go for three of those, and ironically, uh, you want to save states will really help. And I am kind of failing at this. Do 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 do. Yeah, as you can see, this could take a bit, even with safe states. So I, I guess it would really just depend, uh, if you guys are really wanting to try this, it I'm pretty sure it would be worth it if you can actually get all three of the golden poops or whatever. Uh, it'd be really worth it if you can get all three in a row. Because from what I've seen, it will significantly, and I kid you not, sig uh, significantly increase your training stats. Oh my god. Yeah. Do, 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 do. I'm always like one off. Ironically, from what I read too, the third one's always the hardest. So I guess, I mean, I guess it is kind of normal. And I want to try and get this on cam. Do da da. I'm always like one second too fast or too late. Do 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 ah. Uh. I don't know if it's just me or you guys too, but um, it's looking like the slots are going backwards now. Alright, I'm gonna cut off until I get it. So, hold on. Okay, since my eyes cannot take it anymore, I cannot do it. So, so, so like I was saying earlier, not that long ago, I just kept on seeing the reels going backwards. It, it so it's just sorry around my eyes. But with that, I will call this an episode. So see you guys uh, in the next video. Hope you guys enjoyed this. See you guys next time. Have a good day, everyone.